The biggest dilemma that we have in dropshipping and e-commerce is finding a product that sells. So in this video, we've got six new products for you to sell this month. I hope that you enjoy them. I hope that you use them. Let me know if it's useful. Otherwise, let's get right into it. Okay, straight away, we're gonna be looking at the Comfort Curler. So what the hell is a Comfort Curler? Basically, it is a curling machine for long hair. You can attach a hair dryer to it and curls the hair around as it dries. And then you get this nice, like, curled hair effect. So it costs $13.61. The price that people are already selling it at is $29.81. And the profit there would be $16.20. So basically, I'm just gonna go through in this whole video and give you all that you need to know. That is what we do in these videos if you haven't seen them before. Thank you. So in this video, very simple. The target audience for the Comfort Curler would be 18 to 45. And the target interests are beauty and hair products and curler. And you can specify that by using a brand like Trezen. Let's have a look at the AliExpress link. So this is what the product looks like. So some of the features here, lightweight and portable, easy to carry and store, high temperature resistant materials, so it's safe and durable, universal interface for easy installation of the hairdryer itself, and it makes hair naturally curly and beautiful with this curler, not with like a product or something like that. Suitable for salon, professional, and home use. And then we've got a bunch of pictures. I think if you were gonna sell a comfort curler, the best thing to do would be a demonstration video where you showcase exactly how it works. There's one like this on AliExpress already, but I would highly recommend buying it yourself and making a product demonstration to stand out from the crowd. It's so intuitive and it would really work well visually to just showcase what it actually does with a before hair and an after hair. I personally think it's a great winning product because it's completely natural and there's not many moving parts. So it's not gonna break and it's not gonna damage people's hair. It's just a simple curling device and it's very easy to use as well. So the customer themselves are not gonna have any problem using it. You're not gonna have heaps of emails dealing with like FAQs, things like that. Okay, and then we have a double-sided hair remover. You can use this on suits or woolen jumpers, any other clothes, and uh, it's basically just trying to get hairs off of your clothes. So if people have pets, that is a good person to target to as well because pets shed and um, you can just scratch it off with this little lint thing. It costs a very small amount here, $2.27, but people are selling it at $60. I think it's a bit of a stretch there. I'd probably sell it at like $20 just to be like a bit more fair, a bit more ethical. But yeah, some people are getting a profit of $57.63. So pretty broad range here. I'd give it a wide berth in the audience sector of 24 to 54. And then pretty intuitive interests of home and living, um, cleaning and pets. Let's check it out on AliExpress, have a look at the features. So it's double sided, which means that you can just scrape it off and then you can keep scraping without having to like change it. The traditional ones were those like um, linen rollers with like sellotape on them where you could scrub it, but then you'd have to like take off the tape. Whereas with this one, you can just like keep going. Yeah, so it's completely reusable with it's like Velcro material. You don't have to buy like more tape, keep your clothes fresh and clean, uh, obvious. Removing lint has never been easy until now. Keeping your suit line free, your couch clean, and your fabrics spotless. So you want to be targeting the people who care about a clean home. Uh, must have if you own dogs or cats. Yep, that's a bit of an obvious one. You will not find a better brush at a cleaning pet fur off clothes and upholstery. And then it's going to give us dimensions and a bunch of product images. It's quite a good size too. It's about the length of your sleeve. So yeah, real like handy and you can hold it in your pocket. And it even looks nice. I kind of like the red and the little love heart. So yeah. And it's even free shipping. So that's pretty cool too. All right, on to the next product. So this is a branded product of Nikel Smart Pet Walking Leash. You want to be targeting this to people who actually have pets. Bit of a no-brainer there. Sorry if I'm being obvious. <laughs> Thanks, Captain Obvious. So a bit of a high-end product, this one, uh, $44.93 for the cost price, and then the selling price, $99.99, and a yeah, big profit there, $55.06. Target audience, 18 to 45, people who have just bought a pet, obviously would be included in that audience, so target interests would be pet owners, pet supplies, dogs, cats, and then of course, brand names of food, and also like pet gear, within your local area or within the country that you're gonna ship it to. So it's retractable and pretty stylish as well. I think that's the main selling point is like very bougie. So I'd be targeting to upper middle class people and it's even got a nice little charging cable there. So let's have a look at the features. So it actually works for eight hours and the standby battery has got three months. It's got an LED handle, four models. You can change the color of the light and the brightness. 
So it's for like having a safe walk at night with your pet. It's got a big charge time and the nylon leash can be replaced. You can like swap it out for a different one essentially. And it even comes with a little poop bag. So um, just an extra little clip there to help keep all of your pet needs in one place, I guess. It even comes with two different types of charges and the shipping is just $2, well, it's $1.98 to the United States. That one as well would probably benefit from a video ad and it's pretty easy to film. You could just go out at night, walk a dog, there's plenty of animals around and just film the actual use of the product. And it's like real stylish and maybe you could shoot it in like an urban area. Yeah, good luck, let me know how it goes. Okay, and in the pet theme, we're gonna be looking at a remote control snake toy for cats. You know, I used to have a little laser pointer that I play with my cat, Sirius, but you could also use this as well. Cost $16.49, then the price that people are selling it at, at $34.95. The profit then would be $18.46. Target audience there would be pretty wide, 24 to 64. As people begin to settle down, they'll probably buy a pet. And of course, you wanna maximize that by using pet in the interest targeting. Same again, pet owners, pet supplies, pet toys, cats, dogs, you know, things like that. So it comes in a few different colors to suit your house vibe. Oh, that is cool. It's got a little remote control for you to like move the move around and play with your cat. Cool. So charge time of 40 minutes. Oh, it's actually got quite a low play time of 15 minutes, but I guess your cat will probably get sick of it after that. This doesn't come with a video on AliExpress, so it's kind of unsaturated. So I'd recommend that you guys make your own videos with this. And that way you can sort of, you know, stand out from the crowd, as I always say, and you'll be good to go. This would really benefit from just a cat playing with it. You can video the cat playing with it people are gonna get what it is. Okay, and the fifth product is a book-shaped security lockbox. So if you wanna hide things around your house, maybe from your siblings or your parents, or maybe just your flatmates, um, if you wanna be secretive, or maybe it's just kind of cool and stylish to have a little box that is actually hidden as a book. So it costs $15.34, the price is $28.78, and the profit there would be $13.43. So let's have a look at the features on AliExpress. High quality looks like a book, even though it's actually a safe. Adds a sense of mystery to your library, hidden place for cash, jewelry, and it's also portable. There's a little transfer box inside with a lock code and you can it shows you instructions there for how to set it up. Very simple product and it comes with a few different covers. Bible, Eiffel Tower, Marilyn Monroe, Love, Route 66, Butterflies, Italy, and Roses. Again, there's no video. I think just very much that would benefit from a video. <laughs> I'm sorry if I sound like a broken record, but these things are just like so much easier to showcase with a video. The first image doesn't really show me what it is. And then I have to go through second image. Ah, oh, it's a, it's a lockbox, you know? It'd be cool if you just like showed that in a video. People are gonna get it, they're gonna buy it. So for the interest targeting, home safety, security, and decor. Okay, and here is the last winning product. It's an instant Ruby retro kettle. Yeah, they've done a really excellent job on AliExpress of showcasing this product in a lifestyle video. I think it's very beautiful. And I think it's what we should all be doing more of, including people, including beautiful angles in our advertising. It's really quite insane that this isn't happening more often. Just taking the time to have a bit of decor, taking the time to hire somebody and taking the time to match the costume to the product. It's subtly weaving in like the actual use. So showing that it's got different temperatures, showing the capacity. I don't read Mandarin, but I assume it's just showcasing, you know, the types of things that you can use it for. And yeah, I can't really say enough about that beautiful video. So right off the bat, it's $58.40 and it's free shipping to the United States. So that's pretty good. I think this is a winning product because Everybody drinks hot drinks all over the world. People are drinking green tea, matcha, coffee, you know, Ceylon, and you've got such a big market there. But when you go down to the appliance store, your local appliance store, you do have a limited range of options. You've only got this sort of standard coil kettle. Now you've got this really retro groovy electric kettle. And now let's have a look at the competitor store. So we're gonna go back to product number one. And if you've stuck around for this whole video, now we can look at the competitors. Also feel free to check out our slides there at the bottom of the video and you can go through these competitor stores in your own time. Okay, so Cupero and Vida, just showing the images and the features with a nice tick. Straightforward store there. Hopefully this is giving you ideas of how you would do it differently. I might start with the lifestyle photo and they've called it the tornado curler. All right, cool. I don't really have any complaints about this. Let's move on to the double-sided hair remover. Oh, this is nice, nice background. Yeah, it got like an eco vibe, really nice product photos. Oh yeah, this is nice. And the reviews, 
And then, yeah, oh, I love this website. So sleek. I'm a bit biased. I kind of like this um, beige cream white color at the back. And yeah, the color scheme is really nice. See how the, the buy now is the same as the first photo here in that leaf and that green there, that button, just sort of a positive association, positive psychology. This is good. You should buy it. Works pretty well. And it's also just a nice complementary color to the red of the actual product itself. But yeah, black, not too many colors and all of the features there. Nice. Okay, now the walking leash. Oh, that page is missing. Sorry, walk neat. Let's try just going to their page. Nope, looks like their shop's down. Okay, it was just here a couple of days ago. All right, sorry about that one. Let's have a look at the remote control snake. Okay, the product photo is a bit out of focus. You can see at the top there, I mean, it's pretty subtle. I'm being picky, but you can see at the top that it's a slightly different color to the actual background. There's also a lot going on here. Maybe I'm just into the sleek websites. The color scheme's good though, not too many colors. I like the, the cat, they're going with like the pet niche and they're using this cat as an emoji. It's pretty clever. Nice, simple copy as well, like pretty small and easy to understand. Uh, you don't get to pick the color though. That would probably be a good thing to have. Okay, let's move on. This is probably my favorite one. The book shaped security lockbox. Innovative. All right, looks like they've taken their own product photos. Yeah, this is cool. Oh, I think they're using the Debutify theme as well. Yeah, they are. They're using the Debutify theme. That's cool. That's always fun. Yeah, a um, bit busy. I would probably change these size guides. I mean, it's informative, so you're towing the line between informative and like a bit spammy. There's a lot of information there. Also, the colors don't link up with any photos. It's good if those colors are linked. You can do that in Shopify. Same with the large. If you click it, you should be able to see what it looks like. Oh yeah, they've got some nice GIFs in the copy, but yeah, no, it's a good page. Cool, all right, that is that. And then I have two competitor stores with slightly different prices. We have one here selling at 171 New Zealand dollars. So that's 121 USD. So that's more than double, pretty good. And then we have another store, 194 USD. So these guys have gone even more. And I don't even think, I think this is the better website, slightly better, but both of these websites aren't even as good as the original AliExpress because the original AliExpress has the video because they made the video. So this is something I've been banging on about so often in these winning product videos is to make your own content. This product already stands out for the crowd because it's really elegant, but they've really taken it up a notch with this video. So I hope this is inspiring for you. I hope that you can get some friends together, make a video, really lean into what the product does and sell it. We wanna be doing really good creative and we wanna be doing interests that align to this product. So coffee brands for me personally stand out really well. So like Nescafe, bit of a big one, Starbucks. But then I'd also do things in this retro realm. So The Great Gatsby, F. Scott Fitzgerald, people who are actually interested in this 1920s, the roaring 20s decor. It's also mid-century. It could be, um, they've just got a 1920s model in there, but we could go mid-century, even doing things like shows of that time. Peaky Blinders, Mad Men, you know, showcasing that decor with the product. People who've already expressed an interest in this style, that's who you want to be showing this product to. Kind of obvious, but I hope that's uh, useful. In terms of these competitor stores, they're very busy. They're not really taking advantage of the elegance of this product. You know, if I was to sell this product, I would have nothing but a photo on here. I'd make it big, bold, dramatic, showcase just how elegant and simple it is by reflecting the simplicity in your typography and in your landing page. You know, you don't need all of this buy now, get an extra coupon, save, you know, free shipping, all this jazz. Put that below the beautiful product photography. Let the product speak for itself, you know, show don't tell. And then you can get into all the other jazz. You know, this photo here, this beautiful photo of the model and the product should be right at the top. I and mean, it should be big. Kind of what's going on here, but it is a bit smaller. I think there's a lot of room for improvement here. And I hope that you do well with those improvements. Another thing, you can check our slides in the description to see if you are the free theme winner of this month. We give away our theme um, for a month and um, just go click the slides if you wanna see if you're the winner. All right, and that is that. I hope that you learned something today. I hope that those things were valuable for you, if not just inspirational for you to get selling. Let me know in the comments below if you wanna see anything else. Other than that, have a good day. Thanks for watching.